Alright boys, before we get too far into Hunter, there's something I need first. The fabled teak logs. Basically, by doing a quick trick with the teak log, you can be saving yourself exactly one game tick every time you lay a box trap. Which just means that you'll be able to check traps much faster than you would be if you're just setting them down and laying them normally. I mean, a teak log isn't absolutely necessary, you can do this with regular logs, but because you can make multiple things with regular logs, this interface pops up every time and it's super annoying. And I don't know about you guys, but I really don't want to be holding down the one key the entire time I'm doing Hunter, so we're going for the teak log. We have one problem though. The best way to get a teak log right now is to get it from a supply crate from Winter Todd, which means we're gonna need a few things before we get started. Number one is gonna be a steel axe, which requires 31 smithing to make our own. There's nothing else that drops it, as far as I'm aware right now. We're also gonna need level 50 fire making, but that shouldn't be too big of a grind because we already have 44. I'll most likely just go back to Hunter and get those last few levels passively. Again, we're doing all of this so we can get 84 Hunter, which means we'll have the level required to catch every single impling except Dragon. Also, if you're watching this and you aren't subscribed, please consider subscribing to my channel. It really helps me out. I'm not going to be like other YouTubers and fish for your subscriptions. However, I will be setting up some box traps for you, so please take the bait. Alright, I just realized I pretty much have no coins. So I'm going to take these uh, 100 raw salmon down into the manhole. Well, I thought I was going to get way more, <laughs> but that's going to have to do for now. All right, let's watch these levels fly by. Well, I thought they were gonna go faster than that, but that's okay, we'll take it. Somehow I don't have a hammer. That's uh, it's pretty silly, isn't it? Apparently you can access this shop without needing the favor, so. All right, we made it over here, almost. Wait, I'm still at the wrong one? Yeah, we're just gonna go, let's just go with the steel pickaxe. We'll spend our whole bank on it, but that's okay. I don't know if I'm doing this exactly right, but I think I'm, I'm doing it kind of right. It seems like it's working pretty well. Uh, hopefully, I think we have enough ore, so I'm gonna try and smith as much as possible. Hopefully get 31 smithing, that way we can make the steel axe. Okay, we've sort of reached an impasse. I'm gonna go ahead and mine a few more iron ore, just in case. I didn't really think this out. <laughs> I can't smelt my ores here. Okay, I think we are headed back to... Lovakenj. All right, let's hope that we get about 60 iron ore. That way we can go all the way to 31 smithing because if not, I'm gonna cry. You know, this definitely feels like it's less than a 50% rate, man. <laughs> uh, I'll need a lot of arrows to get my level up in order to use my chin. So yeah, we just want as much arrows as we can. 30 smithing. May as well make myself an iron scimitar. There we go. 31 smithing. All that's left is to go get our steel bar real quick. While I've been at it, I probably should have made myself like a steel skimmy, maybe some steel armor, but that's okay. It's not a big deal right now. What matters most is getting that steel axe. Ta-da! There we go. Steel axe has been obtained. Now the plan is to head off to Winter Toad. I'm gonna have to get a few more levels here, but not really that far off. I actually didn't train fire making or wood cutting seriously. I think now we're gonna head to Land's End and I'm gonna just continue with the Hunter. All right, boys, I've just checked and we are halfway to 84 Hunter at this moment, so still got a while to go. Luckily, once we get 80 Hunter, it should speed up to about 350k XP per hour. And also, this Steel Axe is astronomically better than the Bronze Axe, man. The Winter Top levels shouldn't take too long. All right, we're closing in. We got 625 total. We might get another Hunter level. In fact, we probably will get a, another Hunter level since that's what I've, I'm still prioritizing. All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> 16 XP away, um, <laughs> that's awkward. There's 50 fire making, which means we can now burn mahogany logs and we can do winter toad. That's where we're headed next. Here is 79 hunter, nothing there, but one level off to five traps. And here is, come on, is it gonna go? 
Come on. <laughs> one more. Come on, one more log. Okay. 50 wood cutting. We can now do everything we need to do. Hopefully it doesn't take too long to get a mahogany log. All right, just a quick update on the chins so far. 1,643. That is gonna be some juicy range and slayer XP when we get to it. But right now, we gotta catch this winter tot. We'll just start with that, see if we can get it. Hey, we already got a fire making level. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Almost got KO'd right there, damn. All I need is one mahogany log from these crates. That is all I need. Now we can just sit back, relax, and do our logs here. Hey, first winter tod kill. Let's open the supply crate. Yes! We did it, boys. First crate, we got the logs. That's so sick, man. That's all we needed. That's all we needed. However, I forgot that I'm broke, so I'm gonna head back into one more kill. Uh, until at least we get some coins or something. All right, second crate, nothing. We need something that we can sell, or coins. I'll take those too. 60 fire making, that's another milestone. Let's see if we get any coins. I'll take the diamonds, those are fine. 63 fire making, coins please. Yes, we got coins. Well, that's nice. Um, time to leave this place for a while. And we're gonna go buy some feathers. Oh geez, do not buy 50. That was a big mistake. All right, that should do us for now. A thousand feathers. Note to self, watch where you're running because I totally just ran through that skeleton pit back there. <laughs> Not a not the best idea I've ever had. Now this is the run that I absolutely hate. Eventually we'll unlock the minecarts and it won't be a problem. And of course we'll get the talisman and whatnot, but right now it's it's a kind of a brutal run. Alright, we are now back at the pond, which means it is time to edit the video while I do this for a little bit. After that, we're gonna be getting 84 hunter for barehanded ninja implings, which means the only ones that we won't be able to catch at the moment would be the dragon or the lucky imp implings, but um, they're not that crucial in my opinion. The only really good thing you can get from dragon implings is dragon stones, maybe some dragon darts, but they're so niche that, and you won't get a lot of them, that they're not really worth it in my opinion. Hey, there we go, 30 strength. All we need is 30 agility and we'll be able to catch some salmon because I forgot we can't even catch salmon. We have the fishing level, but we don't have the, the agility level. Hey, 60 fishing. That's pretty awesome. It's another 60 skill. By the way, we have not cashed in any points in a long time. I don't really have a reason to right now because I'm not trying to unlock the triple gatherer yet. I don't know, I'm, I'm still debating. I'm not sure if I wanna do that. There we are, 30 agility. We can now do a bunch of stuff, but most importantly, we can catch salmon. There's the salmon. That's right, smash like for salmon. Bro, this has got to be like my Actually, it's, a, it's only my second quiz master, but this means another mystery box, boys. We have the potential. We have the potential to get a dragon stone. Mystery box, of course. What do we got? Oh, look at that, boys. We got ourselves a nice and juicy mithril scimitar. That's awesome. Just hit 40 agility and 41 strength and we are sitting at 67 fishing. So this has not been that bad. I've just been chilling out here for a little bit. Kind of sucks, I'm almost out of feathers and I don't really have that much GP left to go. So I will probably head to sand crabs while I finish editing the first video and we'll kind of go from there, I guess. But you know, once, once the first video is out, then I'll be going back to Hunter, probably get 84 and that should finish us off for the rest of the day, because I gotta go to work. Hey, hey, there we go. We are now qualified to enter the fishing guild, which doesn't matter because we're restricted to Zaya, but hey, it's still a cool level. Well, there's the end of the line, boys. That was my last feather. I have a little bit of cash left, but I don't want to use it on fishing. 
All right, we are now at Sand Crabs. We're gonna be camping here a little while. Um, I'm going for attack levels, and maybe after that I'll get 40 defense just for the achievement points, but also mostly for the defense bonuses, because as you can tell, I am borderline naked right now. There we are. I missed it because of course I'm not really looking at the screen, but we got 40 attack. I'm gonna switch over to defense and hopefully get base 40 melee stats. That'll be a nice way to round things off. Yeah, I'm excited to get back to Hunter as soon as I get done with this stuff. There we are, 40 defense. I still haven't finished the video. <laughs> so I'm gonna switch it back up to strength for a little bit. Get some strength levels. Yeah, we're not done with the video. We're almost there, boys. We're almost there. I know, I keep talking about how I'm gonna make this video, but it's it's, it's a slow process sometimes. Holy shallots. We have just achieved 750 total. Hey, hey, there's another level 40 skill. That's pretty sick. 50 strength. These levels are really just flying in. I swear, every time I look over, it's another milestone. Uh, but yeah, we're still going, going strong. Ooh, yes, yes. This is totally uh, a waste of XP. We needed a pair of pants. Oh, that is, that is some fancy stuff right there. Lads, we just got a clue scroll. Um, let's go do it real quick, again. I am so glad that I got the run energy. I can't imagine if I had to walk this. Hey, there's the casket. Alright, our second clue scroll casket. What are we gonna get? That is pretty terrible, I'm not gonna lie. Hey, actually, the black pickaxe is better than my steel one. So, I mean, I, I, I guess it's an upgrade, right? Alright, we're here. We're back hunting for a little bit. And surprisingly, no one is here, which is awesome because I am planning to go hard, at least to get 84. That's the goal. Okay, so I'm extremely smart and I don't have the fletching level for this mahogany log. Go figure that one out. We're just spamming the oak logs just to get some faster rates. It's not bad, I just suck at it. So hopefully by the time I actually can use the mahogany log, it'll be worth it. Hey, there we go, finally. 80 Hunter, we can now catch five traps. We can do crystal implings if we had a net and we can do herbivore. Yeah, so now I'm not exactly sure what to do because on my list here, I have get 50 fire making, which we did, then get the mahogany log and then go barb fishing. I guess we could go back and get the teak log, level 46. So, I mean, we could just go get 46 fletching. It's not a big deal if we, to get that. Boys, we messed up. Uh, I don't have a house. So I haven't been getting construction XP. All right, let's buy our starter house for 1,000 coins. Ta-da, there goes our coins. And back to Winter Tot. I'm tempted. No, we're so close to it. And we're back at Winter Tot once again. Yeah, we're just here for the fletching XP. All right, let's see, what do we got? That is terrible. I thought of something kind of clutch. If you turn on the entity hider for Rune Light, you don't have to see anyone else it makes this a lot easier some u logs okay apparently everyone already uses entity hider here so i don't know what i'm doing <laughs> i guess i'm the last one to figure that out also we're chilling at 66 fire making yeah we're just gonna keep going until we get the fletching level and we also need the log too so yeah i'm dying i'm gonna have to go over here all right seventh crate there we are 70 fire making I was gonna start banking these supply crates so I don't have to keep taking a clip every time, but uh, I don't have any pyromancer. I only have one item of warm clothing, so it's probably just best that I just open these. Ooh, we got what we needed right there. Well, that solves one part of the equation. And that is the worst one, but hey, it looks flashy. And there's 40 fletching, another 40 skill, which will get us another task points. Which, by the way, we still have 230 because I haven't claimed any. And there is 41 fletching. Now we have the level for teaks. We can head back to Hunter after this game. Okay, we just got 73 fire making. And what do we got in the crate? That is okay though. I'm, I believe we have the fletching level now. Let me just double check this. Oh, I need 46, man. I am. I don't know what I'm talking about. We still got a long ways to go. Hey! Check it out, we got some burnt pages. Don't drop those. Um, <laughs> those will be very useful once I get a Tomb of Fire 
Hey, somehow we got over a thousand points. And there's 45 fletching, one more level, and we can finally leave this place for good. There we go, finally, level 46, and we just got 800 total level. I might stick around just to get 80 fire making real quick, that way I can get the points for it. I am starting to think that it might not be worth holding out on the relics just to do fishing. I mean, with the triple loot, it'll be kind of annoying, but it won't be undoable. Like, you'll still be able to do it, it'll just be a little bit more work. And fishing isn't the most important thing Anyways, agility is, but fishing, not really. So I might just unlock those perks. Yeah, let's just do it now. Oh, we're at a thousand points, cool. <laughs> All right, we're doing Hardcore Harvester. Yeah, that's gonna make this a lot easier. We'll probably get a thousand points each time too. I don't know why I did not do this earlier. All right, this should be the last game and we can leave. I'm gonna try out just doing the logs instead of fletching them. Hey, there's 80 fire making. I'm gonna go ahead and claim that right off the bat. That way I can get my relics for artisan. And now we're getting double experience in all of our artisan skills, that's insane. I'm gonna go ahead and try out one more game just to see how much XP we can get with the double experience. Okay guys, this is really crazy. <laughs> rune light, I just reset rune light and it says I'm getting 2.5 million experience per hour. That's, that's ridiculous. <laughs> and that's only at 81. Ooh, and that double construction XP is coming in clutch too. And with this method, we're able to hit 1000 points every time. 80k XP. <laughs> it's crazy. Hey, there's my Bruma Torch, I'll take that. Yeah, with these Trouts at 47 cooking, it says I'm getting 700k XP per hour. And there's 49 cooking. All right, we are finally back to doing Hunter. It's actually been like at least 24 hours since I did this. Yeah, the plan is just to pump up some music and just grind it out, boys. Hey, there's 81 Hunter. We're going pretty strong, as you can tell. I'm starting to get this method down, actually. It's like that, boom, boom. Then I'm also getting some passive fletching experience from the oak logs as well, so. Overall, this method is not bad. And especially these arrow shafts are gonna come in handy uh, when I start training range with all these chinchampas. We need arrows in order to get to the level that we're gonna use the Chinchampas at. The Gatherer is really helping out with the, I mean, it's not that big of a deal, but it does give us some extra logs that we can fletch with. So that means we spend less time wood cutting and more time fletching. I wonder how many teak logs are gonna mess up. Hey, we finally got a world to ourselves. This is gonna make things so much faster. Ah, there we go, 83, 275k to the last level, and we are done for a long time. There we go, 51 fletching, doesn't mean a thing, but uh, the levels are getting a lot slower now. And I just messed up my teak stock because I wasn't paying attention. Also, I may as well show you right now, our total stack of chins is 2,621. All right, we're coming up on the last level for Hunter. And there, I wasn't paying attention, so there goes my teak, but oh well. We're almost done, so don't really need to worry about that right now. There we go. 
84 freaking Hunter. Doesn't even say anything about it, but let me show you. 84, we can now do barehanded ninja implings. We're done. Pick up our traps and get over to Winter Toad.